Hey everybody, Pretty and Flawed here. So today we're going to have a serious chat about hair. Okay. I have shown in the past that I was uh, starting to take some vitamins, the Vitafusion vitamin uh, gummies, because I explained in that video and I'll start it all over again. I always had long, thick hair. At some point, I don't know what happened. I don't know if it was after my baby. And I know people would say that after, you know, the hormones and everything, your hair tends to change or whatever. No. It's been a long time and my hair was still shedding really, really bad. And it just, I could not get it to get thick again. It used to be really thick to where, you know, I would even complain like, oh, my hair is too thick. Right. That's how I ended up going relaxed. Um... So, over some time, I was losing the thickness of my hair, and I was, um, which was causing me to lose length because I kept cutting it and um, trying to make sure that I wasn't having split ends and thinking that that was the problem. Well, that wasn't the problem. I still, to this day, don't know what the problem was with my hair. Um, I am a bit of a product junkie, so when I was having that problem, I started using certain things, different shampoos, different conditioners, trying to balance it out. I went through um, the black Jamaican castor oil. I tried um, that. Okay, let me tell you. I didn't like that. Now, everything, every product is not for everybody, so I'll, I'll give you my opinion. The Jamaican black castor oil, oh my lord, I cannot ever do that again for the simple fact that it was super, it was thick, and they have different versions of it. I tried to. It, both of them, I did not like it. I didn't like the way it made my hair feel. Um, it was kind of thick and and. It just was not for me. And then there was um, two different smells that I smelled. One was kind of okay, and then the other one was just, um, it smelled like tar. So I couldn't deal with either one of those. So I did try that. The pure coconut oil, the kind that you, you know, that everybody is using for their hair. I tried it. It made my scalp itch really, really, really bad. So I couldn't use that. I mean, I've, but I've been through different products, different products, and nothing has worked. Now, let me tell you guys about this Virgo hair fertilizer. And if you've been following me, if you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe to stick around. But if you've been following me for a long time, you guys know, well, I try to pride myself on giving you guys like a complete honest review of a product and this product is not sponsored in this video I pay for this by myself and I just wanted to share this information with you guys because you guys is my girls and you know I love to tell you guys when I find something that is super awesome just like I told you guys about those vitamins so I hope you still taking them okay so this Virgo hair fertilizer you guys what rock was I living under? Where have I been at? Why hadn't I tried this before? Okay, so this hair fertilizer, um, it says, and hair conditioning cream for rapid and healthy hair growth. Um, it tells you how to use it. It says the ingredients that's in it is herbal extract, petroleum jelly, peppermint oil, lanolin, and fragrance. Now, I kind of was like with the petroleum jelly I was like eh. but then I was like okay I'm, I'm still gonna give this a try right so let me tell you guys I've been using this for one month okay let me tell you how it says to use it apply and massage Virgo hair fertilizer into your hair and scalp every day comb and style as desired for a healthy strong and natural looking hair it tells you to use it every day okay now we're gonna get into how I use it and what I think about this so for the past month what I've been doing is I can't use this every day for the simple fact that um, it's um, it kind of is like a grease and I don't really like my hair to be super duper greasy and weighed down. So what I do and what is literally working for me. And like I said you guys, everybody's hair, everybody's 
you know experience is different but for the most part this is what's working for me and I will not change it I will not change it and then I'm gonna tell you guys a story about my first time using this because it was crazy so what I've been doing is I wash my hair once a week anyway so what I'm uh, I would wait okay so let's just let me give you a scenario today is let's say it's Monday and I plan on washing my hair on Friday so what I'll do is I'll wait until Wednesday and then I'll grease my scalp with it um, and I'll go through and kind of show you that I'll grease my scalp with this and then on Wednesday and then that way on Friday it'll be on my scalp for two days and then on Friday night I'll just wash my hair and do my normal routine with washing my hair and using the products that I use after that so basically I'm putting this on and I'm letting it sit on my scalp for two days because that's about as much as I can as long as I can go with my hair being greasy and and it's not really thick like don't don't let me scare you and think make you think that it's like a really thick grease like your hair is super way down it's not it's still really night nice and light but it's just me I just don't like the like to have grease in my hair really so but for the sake of growing my hair back and getting it thick I'm dealing with what I have to deal with so like I said on Wednesday I'll grease my scalp that night and then Friday night I'll wash my hair and I've been repeating that every week you guys my hair feels so different I'm gonna sit this down now my hair feels so different usually when I'm running my fingers through my hair and I am relaxed I've been through the the um, natural stages before and um, I was shedding and losing a lot of hair in the natural stages as well really bad so I don't know I think my hair just tends to grow better and you know with the re with relaxed hair I know some people will frown their face upon that or whatever but like I said everybody is different what works for one person might not work for the next so anyways when I use this as I'm using this my hair is already you know like I said I get length already I have cut a lot of my hair off um, in the past couple months because I was thinking that it was uh, dead ends and everything and so I've been cutting my hair now as you can see right here it goes about here I won't pull on it and tug on it I don't know if I'm gonna use this video as like to go back and reference it later um, as far as the growth but I'm just showing you and used and it used to be when I would run my hands through my hair I would literally like pull it and I would have like lots of hair coming out as far as shedding I have not been <clears throat> experiencing that you guys this stuff is like a miracle I'm loving it now so that this video is not like super long I'm gonna show you how I use it really quick as I'm telling you this story <clears throat> and then we'll be finished so it looks like this and you guys whoo the peppermint oil in here is no joke no joke at all so what I do is it looks like that and it's like this really green like that and you can see how it's kind of thick so what I'll do is I'll just put some in front of me uh, on like this little plate or shelf or whatever so let me tell you guys as I'm doing this because I'm going to show you how I do it and I don't really part my hair I just kind of you know move it around just a little bit so I can get and I just basically I just basically grease my scalp with this okay so let me tell you guys as I'm doing this so the very first time that I used this and I took it out the box right I was putting it in my hair well I put it in my hair and then sometimes after I'm done um, and I'm doing thick parts I don't do it like tiny tiny parts I like them to be really spread out because I don't want a whole lot of this like overwhelming me because you guys this peppermint oil is um, very potent in this so you don't need to do really really tiny parts because what you're going to do afterwards is you kind of massage it into your scalp and you will definitely feel your scalp tingling um i'm trying to do this through the camera so sorry but you will feel your scalp tingling and that's a good thing at first i was like whoa like what's going on but that is a very very
good thing and I and it and it really works so okay so I did what I'm doing right now and I put it in my hair and I didn't know any better I don't know what I was thinking so later on that evening I must have was you know I was laying there and I was watching TV and I went to scratch my scalp you know I did the whole little you know scratch my scalp real quick because the, the peppermint oil was had it tingling and it felt good but it made it feel kind of like itchy a little bit so I scratched it and I must have been sitting there and I was like you know you know sometimes I touch my face and I must have just did like this and rubbed my eye or something like that honey let me tell y'all my eyeball felt like you know how when you chew some spearmint gum or something and then you drink some water <laughs> you know that airy breezy feel that you get in your mouth where it's like like you can blow ice out of your mouth girl oh my my eyeball was the freshest it had ever, ever been it felt so cold like I had an ice pack on my it felt like I had an ice pack on my eyeball so warning see I even need a little bit more I only squeeze that a little bit so warning you guys if you put this in your hair oh do not I repeat do not scratch your head without washing your hands and accidentally <laughs> touch your eyes or yeah because this is this this product is is no punk it's it's strong and it's doing it does what it's supposed to do so I only have a little bit more to do let me just quickly do this real quick and then we'll be we'll wrap this up okay you guys so that's how I do that and it's really quick and and easy but it's just really sticking to it um um I don't know if I'm leaving out any information um if I am just ask me down below I will do a follow-up video in the future to maybe just kind of look and see how the growth is and you know where my hair is going with this but you guys I'm telling you this is awesome it will help you grow out your edges it will help your hair to get thicker right now my hair my scalp is tingling what I didn't do um, because the baby is in the background but what I didn't do yet is massage my scalp and so what I'll do is I'll just sit there and massage my scalp a little bit and then like I said two days from now I'll just go ahead and wash my scalp or wash my hair and treat it regularly I'll go from Friday all the way back um, until I'll just I usually just choose a day when I feel like I, I want to wash my hair I just do it two days before I know I'm gonna wash my hair so I can't give you a time frame because I switch that up often um, but it is once a week and two days before my wash so um, I hope this helped any of you I did get this at my local beauty supply it was $9.99 um, I have seen that you can order it online but make sure um, you check your beauty supply and um, yeah so you guys oh let me tell you it does say that it is um, it's not written in English but it's made in Nigeria so very very good product I just wanted to come and talk to you guys about this and show you and let you know what I'm doing and if you're um, if you need some help some hair growth help Please try this out as, as well as the VitaFusion vitamins that I showed you in a previous video. Try those as well in conjunction with this. It will probably amaze you like really. So okay you guys let me get up out of here because he's running around clicking toys and I don't want the video to get all loud and long. So I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Bye. Bye.